welcome to the mathematics in my channel today we are going to solve another interesting integral integral from 0 to 1 natural log of x arctan of x dx well first i am going to take this integral is equal to i and then we know this is equal to integral from 0 to 1 natural log of x now instead of arctan of x we can use a series so we can write infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity minus 1 to the n plus 1 times x to the 2n minus 1 over 2n minus 1 here dx okay now we can switch the integral sign and sigma notation so we can write now this is equal to infinite sum 1 to infinity here we have minus 1 to the n plus 1 over 2n minus 1 uh, then integral of integral from 0 to 1 uh, x to the 2n minus 1 x to the 2n minus 1 times natural log of x d x okay then um, we can take a substitution so if we take uh, minus u is equal to natural log of x minus u is equal to natural log of x then we know we can isolate the x x is equal to e to the minus u then differentiate so dx is equal to minus e to the minus u d u okay now we can plug in here so we know now infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity minus 1 to the n plus 1 over 2 n minus 1 now um, lower limit when x approaches to 0 uh, we know u approaches to infinity so infinity when x approaches to 1 uh, upper limit we know u approaches to 0 okay now x is equal to e to the minus u so e to the minus u raised to the 2n minus 1 then natural log of x we know here yeah, len uh, means natural log so natural log of x we know minus u uh, then dx dx is equal to minus e to the minus u d u okay now we can simplify uh, we know this minus sign and this minus sign uh, get cancelled uh, and if we take minus sign as a factor common factor we know uh, lower limit and upper limit change so we can write minus uh, infinite sum 1 to infinity here minus 1 to the n plus 1 over uh, then here 2n minus 1 uh, integral from 0 to infinity now here we have u times e to the uh, minus u to the minus 1 power here e to the minus u so we get cancel and here now we have e to the minus 2u n and here d u okay now again uh, we can take a substitution so if we take uh, t is equal to 2 times u n now differentiate so dt is equal to 2 n times d u okay now uh, here we can plug in so now we can write uh, this is equal to minus uh, n is equal 1 to infinity minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over 2 n minus 1 now limit uh, we know also uh, 0 to infinity so 0 to infinity now u is equal to t over 2 over sorry t over 2n so t over 2n times here e to the now 2un we know t so minus t and du is equal to 1 over 2n times d t okay then hmm, here 2 times 2 4 so minus 1 over 4 minus 1 over 4 infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity 
uh, and here we have minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over uh, here in n, n square we know constant so we can write outside of the integral sign so here n square to n minus 1 uh, integral from 0 to infinity now here we have uh, t times e to the minus t d t okay now we know uh, this integral uh, this is equal to 1 and uh, then we can write uh, this is equal to minus 1 over 4 uh, infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, minus 1 to the n plus 1 power and here n square over 2n minus 1 so I am going to write uh, here uh, 2n minus 2n minus 1 then 2n minus 2n get cancelled minus minus 1 so it's okay and here in the denominator we will have n square times 2n minus 1 okay then uh, we can write here this is equal to minus 1 over 4 infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity minus 1 to the n plus 1 power uh, here uh, now if we divided by uh, 2n uh, by n square times 2n minus 1 we know this n get cancelled and here 2 over uh, n times 2n minus 1 then minus now 2n minus 1 get cancelled and here 1 over n square okay then uh, next if uh, if we multiply by 1 over n square so we know here plus so plus 1 over 4 infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over n square and now if we multiply by uh, this term so we know here now uh, minus sign and this 2 this uh, this 4 so 2 get cancelled and here 1 over 2 uh, infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, here now we have minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over uh, 2n minus uh, yeah n times 2n minus 1 n times 2n minus 1 okay then mm, here 1 over 4 and we know uh, this is equal to 5 square over 12 5 square over 12 and uh, then uh, this term we can write uh, minus infinite sum minus infinite sum minus 1 to the n plus 1 power and uh, I'm going to write 2n minus 2n minus 1 uh, over here 2n times 2n minus 1 because these two uh, I wrote in here this place okay then mm, we can write here 5 square over 48 uh, and uh, then again if we multiply by this term we know this is equal to uh, now plus uh, one half infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity now 2n minus 1 get cancelled and uh, 1 over n okay then if we multiply by this term we know uh, minus infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over uh, now 2n get cancelled and here we have 2n minus 1 okay now here 5 square over 48 uh, here plus 1 half and we know uh, sorry here we have uh, minus 1 to the n plus 1 power so minus 1 to the n plus 1 power over n uh, we know natural log of 2 and uh, this it is we know minus pi over 4 okay this is the answer if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching